At Stanford, we care about big issues and big challenges. We are part of a civic democracy, and as such, we have an obligation and a privilege to vote in this upcoming election on November 8th. Democratic societies give to citizens an enormous number of rights and privileges, and they only ask a few responsibilities of us in return. One of those responsibilities is to vote. It's an opportunity for me to exercise my right as an American citizen. It's a precious opportunity to make a difference in our communities, in our country, and in the world. Voting matters to me because it determines our future and what happens with our children. That really makes a big difference. This year, I won't just be voting for the President of the United States. This election, I'm voting for progress. For equal pay. For science and education. For climate change. For improved access to education. Minimum wage change. For racial equality. For sexual assault prevention. To support the construction of more affordable housing. For mental health and criminal justice reform. To ensure that all voices, particularly marginalized voices, are heard. I'm going to turn out to vote in order to sustain the legitimacy of our democratic process. Our generation has the lowest political turnout out of any other generation. Participation is part of what will keep uh, this democracy going. Your voice, no matter how strong, slow, or unclear, matters in our government. Every vote matters. Your vote matters. Every vote matters. Your vote matters. Your vote matters. Your vote really matters. Vote on November 8th. Vote. Vote. November 8th. Vote! Go vote! November 8th. Vote! Vote! Go vote! Send in your absentee ballot. November 8th. Go card, go vote. 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 <laughs>